Hi, I'm Darren Orff. I'm a cybersecurity and privacy partner with PwC that focuses on full stack cloud security. And I oversee all of the cybersecurity and privacy work that we do with United Airlines. Shreya, thanks so much for joining us today. Why don't I kick it over to you for a brief intro and then we can kind of get into the questions here. Sure, thanks Darren. I'm Shreya, a principal cloud security architect at United Airlines. And my team primarily focuses on cloud architecture application security. So we primarily work with teams to make sure that their cloud infrastructure is configured securely. Um, right now, we're really focusing on our cloud security automation efforts. So why don't we kick it off here by having you provide a brief overview of where United Airlines is in its cloud journey. Sure. So United's cloud journey really started a couple years ago. Um, but in the past year, we recognized that a lot more applications wanted to either build new or migrate their applications to the cloud to take advantage of all that the cloud offered. Because of the fast pace of business and IT, we recognized that there was some friction that we were seeing from security. Um, we were often seen as roadblocks or something that would slow an application down in modernizing. So we went out to modernize the way we did things and support a more agile or DevOps way of doing things. As a part of our cloud automation efforts, I wanted to make sure that we were really meeting that demand before there was a demand and making security as easy as possible for teams that were trying to take advantage of the speed that they could do things in the cloud. Great. So can you describe, give, us, give the audience a little bit of a sense of how security fits into your corporate culture and how that evolved over time? Yeah, so for as long as I can remember, security has really been top of mind across our organization, from our leadership to our application teams. I think some of this stems from our core four principles, which are broad across the enterprise, which focus on being safe, caring, dependable, and efficient. In this case, safety is really what we're focusing on, and we're taking it beyond just being physically safe or feeling safe inside the airport or an aircraft, and we're looking at our cyber safety and keeping our employee and customer data safe. Can you give us a little bit of a sense of uh, what your current cloud security goals are and then how you're working towards those as a team? Yeah, so... Our top goal is making security as easy as possible for application teams inside the cloud. So in, this, in my mind, this means moving teams as fast as possible, reducing paperwork, and leveraging automation wherever possible. Something that we've really put a lot of time and effort into recently is our policy as code effort. Um, in order for teams to deploy inside our AWS environment, we require that teams templatize their infrastructure. So leveraging that principle, we're able to apply our enterprise and cloud security policies on top of that template and prevent teams from actually deploying if we see something scary that's happening. All right, that was great, Shreya. Can you, can you expand on that a little bit further and tell us how are you using AWS in a more broad enterprise sense? Sure. From a cloud perspective at United, we're primarily an AWS shop. Um, when applications are moving into the cloud, we really want them to be cloud smart. So that means modernizing the application as much as possible when we're moving into the cloud. And when we're developing, using all of the features that the cloud has to offer. So things like micro-segmentation, utilizing microservices, and from my perspective, you know, taking advantage of how easy it is to do security in AWS. So some of our audience may be thinking, where does PwC come into play in all this? So Shreya, can you just give a little bit of a sense of the collaboration between United Airlines, AWS, and PwC? Yeah, PwC and AWS have both had fantastic relationships with United and my team over the past couple of years. Both have been very instrumental in giving us perspective on best practice or um, specific engineering guidance, helping us modern and automate and embedding security as a part of our engineering activities. So I know we're really early in the journey still here, but uh, perhaps you could share some of you know, the notable outcomes or benefits that you've realized so far. Sure. Yeah. Um, 
we've been seeing a lot of benefits and truly I expect a lot more to come. Um, we've gotten really great feedback from application teams about how um, easy we're making cloud security, which you know I, I think is is really big because that is like a part of our our goals. Um, we're making cloud security super transparent, so we're giving application teams really like, exactly what they need to do in order to be good from a security perspective. From the point that they are saying, "Hey, you know, I have an idea for an application." Which for an application team, when they're trying to move super fast and they're trying to, you know, really take advantage of all the cloud offers, that's huge. Couldn't agree more. Standardization absolutely is uh, is, is foundational to be able to automate and scale the way that United is uh, is trending. So I know we're uh, almost out of time here, but so to close, maybe uh, what. What would be best here is if you could give us a sneak peek into what's next in your cloud journey and really bringing that vision to life for United. Yeah. So after PAC, what we're really trying to do is also implement some CSPM capabilities. So not only have that pre-deployment view of you know what will be going into the environment and what can we stop, but also look at what is in the environment and that continuous compliance of maintaining good and seeing that we are good. Great. Well, it's a really exciting journey and we're really, uh, really enjoyed being on this, uh, on this journey with you. So thank you for uh, very much for, for sharing all of this and providing uh, the insights to our audience.